Hey guys, Sparka has gotten a rework on the PvE. I decided to check it out last night while the servers were down, so enjoy the video. Alright, some time to check out the new Soraka build. Oh, I don't even have... My Soraka, like my... Usual masteries, so I can't use it. Um... Let's see. Active restores 110 plus 20 health to target ally at 34. So that's a pretty good ratio. Cannot be cast if Soraka is below 5% health. Each enemy champion hit by Star, Car Star Call heals Soraka for 20 to 40 plus 14 based on missing HP. My ADC is not an ADC, but that's okay. Calls down a star. Actually. I'm going top lane. Hopefully, in Zillion will leave. No! No! I'm supposed to be working with you, Ash! Ash, no, don't leave me! <sighs> I guess I'll work up here. Each enemy champion hit by Star Call heals Soraka. So it calls down stars. That's the same thing as it was before, except standing in center take 150% damage and are slowed by 20% for 2 seconds. Ouch. Gracefully. Okay, well let's try... starting up here, I guess. This is my path. Let's see. Come on, do something interesting. Attack him or something so I can heal him. Never waste a breath. Oh my gosh. Are you seriously not going to attack Zillion? I heed their call. Come on, attack him. Attack him, I say. Chief's leader's just ignoring him. What the heck? Fine. I'll take the aggressive. Let's see how that works. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty. I really like that. Come on, are you going to... Why me? I can't heal myself. Oh, there we go. Well, he's taking that. Okay, so I have 509 health currently. Well, 500 health currently. 400 health. Oh, I wish I could heal myself. Oh my gosh, that changed. I didn't realize. I assumed it was the same as it was before. This is my That's kind of cool. <gasps> That's so pretty. I can't heal myself. Can I heal like that? This is just enemy champions. Each enemy champion. That is annoying. I guess I want to make her more aggressive. I want to heal myself. I just love that attack. It's so cool. Does that do damage? No, it doesn't do damage anymore. That's annoying. You're taking away the damages, like the silences that do damage. <gasps> I got health back. Oh, that's a. Why didn't that hit me? That was a really pretty animation.
There we go. Thanks, Alien. <laughs> huh, not being able to heal myself was really weird. Okay. I wonder if I go here if my ADC will say Here, have health. Well wait a minute, why did she have a plus sign above her head? I wanna max my cute Why does she have a plus sign above her head? What what the heck? Did my W do something? No. Oh my gosh, I do not like these changes. I'm still trying to figure out what that plus sign is. Oh wait a minute. Why are you here? I'm down in this lane now. What is that plus sign? What does it mean? Focus ashes next second. I don't. I don't know what it was. Do I don't understand. Do you get it? I don't know what that bu that thing was. I do really like the animation for that though. Which is power increases. By 50% HTML below 40 health. So that's kind of normal. Oh no, he has the thingy! I don't know what that means! What does that mean? What does it mean? Maybe it's something on mine. Yay, hell. It's gonna be really good for... I don't... Oh, wait a minute, does that mean she's less than 40% of her health? Yeah, she is. Okay. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, I can run faster! That's what it is, it's her new passive. So I could gain 70% bonus movement speed when running towards the allies who are below 40% health. Touch a cosmos, 20% of Soraka's bonus magic resist and bonus armor is replaced by ability power. 1 AP for each point of armor or magic resist. Pretty cool. <gasps> That's so cool. I like that. Ah, it's so pretty! No, he's so far away from me! <laughs> oh, I bet I know why Soraka bot was messing around now. Like, messing up. Probably a situation of she was spazzing out because her bot fellow bots were too low. Damn, timing that is really hard. I can't heal myself. I need to hit enemy champion. There we go. Was he following me? Oops. Um, if I'm not careful, I could be executed. Because I can't heal myself! Gracefully. <sighs> that is really annoying. Okay, 
Um. Well, I want to test something. I want to get Mobos with plus 20 movement speed. So let's sell that. And then I want to go near somebody who is super low. Okay, so my movement speed is 453 right now. So let's get someone really low. And I'll see how fast my movement speed gets done. Oh, wait a minute. Six hundred. Oh my gosh. I had six hundred movement speed just from having mobos and running towards someone who was hurting. Oh my gosh. That's funny. How fast can I go then? I shall have to figure that out. Nice. See, I need to get all the movement speed I can get. And then I worked for a half an hour to get the items to get the fastest speed possible. Decided to spare you the boring video. I was half asleep by this time. It's about 6 in the morning for me. So. Okay. Come on, let's have it activate. I heed their call. Shut down. You're not below half health. Come on, get below half health. This is my Okay, I hit everything. So we shall see how that worked out. Okay, I did it. I'm forfeiting. Seriously? Hey, thanks for watching this. I do want to say, because I failed to say in the recording, that I don't like this Soraka rework. They are making her a support-only champion who's going to possibly have trouble even staying alive, period. If you're trying to not KS, it's going to be hard to get your health back. And if they have a very pokey team, you're going to quickly get to a point where you can't keep your ADC alive in laning phase. The visuals with this are beautiful. They really are. But beyond this, it's a terrible update to a great champion. Also, I tried to play her with the normal skin. The particles seem the same, but I will be checking the other skins soon. Anyway, make sure to subscribe for more PvE, regular league, and other games, of course. Thanks for watching, guys.